This is Mayor Paul Broder. The weekly DPH COVID-19 statistics have been released and Melrose stands at 350 positive cases as of six o'clock tonight. This represents an increase of eight over last week's report. Melroseans have received 19,620 tests, which represents an increase of 1,815 over last week's numbers. Our percent positivity rate is again essentially unchanged and now stands at 0.61%. Nonetheless, we are still classified as yellow under the state's assessment system. As I explained last week, we need our average daily incidence rate for 100,000 over a 14-day period to drop below four to get back to green, and we are currently at 4.4. By following good public health practices, like wearing our face coverings, maintaining that social distance of six feet, washing our hands, and staying home when you have symptoms, our community is making terrific progress. And again, please remember that if you want a free test, the state Stop the Spread program continues to offer them as close as Square One Mall in Saugus, and that's one of 18 sites across Massachusetts. You do not need to have symptoms to get a, uh, this test, and it is easy to access. And finally, another reminder that the Melrose Board of Health will be holding a family flu clinic tomorrow, October 15th, from 5 to 8 p.m. The location will be in the middle school gym, and you should enter that parking lot on Melrose Street across from Ashland Street. Everyone three years of age and older is eligible. And if you missed our earlier clinic on October 4th, you are welcome at this event. Please fill out the insurance form that is available online and bring it with you to the site. All insurance carriers will be accepted except Aetna and United Healthcare, and a fee of $15 will be charged to anyone not using an insurance carrier. However, nobody will be turned away based on an inability to pay. So please take advantage of this opportunity. And again, be sure to bring your insurance card if you have one, the completed insurance form, and wear short sleeves in order to make the process easier. And a link where more information does appear on the screen. Again, I wanna thank everyone for doing all you can to keep each other safe. Keep it up and together we will get through this. Thank you.